of the Shell Oils British Grand Prix of 1986. The lights for red and go! And Mansell is way he's been passed by Senna, he has been passed by Berger, he's been passed by both the McLarens, PK leads, Senna is second, Berger is third, a terrible start for Nigel Mansell and a big coming together and Hannah. And we've got a, we've possibly got a red flag. Yes, we have got uh, a red flag at the start and finish point and black flags everywhere else around the circuit. The rule is that when the race is being stopped as it is, that is the procedure. And uh, a very bad start for Nigel Mansell. Can this be his lucky day on the restart? He's going to have a second crack at it. Well, now let's have a look at what happened in that crash on the very first corner. Thierry Bootson, starting from 13th place on the grid in his arrows, goes across the track for some reason that he knew not, into the armco. The arrows spins round. Bootson is totally out of control. The drivers behind him cannot avoid him. Jonathan Palmer T-bones him. The rest pull to the right. Jack Lafitte goes into the armco, and the race is stopped. So the race was stopped for what seemed like an interminable hour and a quarter, whilst the unfortunate Lafitte was gently and expertly removed from his car with what turned out to be two broken legs. Lafitte was taken to Sidcup Hospital five miles away by helicopter. And when the helicopter returned, part two of the British Grand Prix began.